got some pre-order bonuses for Splatoon 3. I'm Crafty Type 1, and in this video, I'll be letting you guys know all the bonuses that come with Splatoon 3 on every realtor that's offering them. So let's just get right into it. But before we get into that, this video is sponsored by Inkbrush Academy, an awesome Splatoon 3 Discord server that is growing super fast, closing in on 2,000 members. They have awesome Splatoon content like tournaments every Saturday and weekly events for you to do. So if you haven't already, go ahead and check them out in the description below where we're also doing a giveaway on there as well. But let's get into the video. If you haven't pre-ordered Splatoon 3 and are planning to get the physical edition, many retail companies have announced some pre-order bonuses. So let's just start off with the one, the only GameStop. GameStop advertises a free sticker set if you pre-order and purchase it. Personally, I'm not really a big fan of stickers, but Splatoon 3 has really good graffiti and it looks like that's what it is inspired here. It's not just the logo and some inklings, it's Splatoon Graffiti. Next, we have the My Nintendo Store, which I did recommend as the number one place to pre-order the Splatoon 3 OLED. So if you wanted to pick up the game as well, you could get a gym bag and squid pin. Personally, the squid pin doesn't really look that good, but the gym bag though has a really nice texture to it. And if you're pre-ordering the OLED from the site anyways, might as well pick it up. If you guys haven't watched that video, you should watch it right after this one. Next pre-order bonus that was announced is a pretty obscure one from thegamecollection.com. This site is based in the UK, but they do ship internationally. So if you are planning to pre-order from this site, expect around a week shipping time. But by far, this is one of the coolest pre-orders being an Octoling and Inkling keyring. They look like they're really good quality and you get both of them. And if that's not enough, you also get 429 reward points with their site, which is like $4.29 cash back. And the last retail store I have on this list is Walmart, by far having the best pre-order bonus being a nine inch Inkling plush. We didn't get any specification on the material. It does look like it's made out of nylon, so nothing that's gonna last too long under heavy conditions. But there's four different variations. And we also don't know if you get to choose the color or do they get randomly picked for you. And if you want all four, good luck buying four copies of Splatoon 3. And if you guys are wondering, all these sites price Splatoon at $59.99 being the base $60, except for the game collection, which does give you that $4.90 credit back. Normally Walmart does discount their games a little more. So if you're on the lookout, go ahead and check out Walmart a little closer to launch to see if they do do that. We do have two major retail stores that normally do pre-order bonuses that haven't done them yet. That being Target and Amazon. Normally Target announces their pre-order bonuses three weeks before launch. So we are coming up on that release date soon. But judging by past pre-order bonuses, it could be a journal, sticker, magnet, or pin. And Amazon just is all over the place. Sometimes they do pre-order bonuses bonuses sometimes they don't whoa 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 future crafty here while editing this video amazon did announce their pre-order bonus that being a yellow squid pin the same pin that you would get with the gym bag from the my nintendo store amazon normally prices their games at 50 dollars. so if you want the game for cheaper and don't want the gym bag and this kind of bad squid pin amazon would be the way to go but that's for you to decide. But let me know in the comment section down below what pre-order bonuses you might be getting. Or are you just gonna buy it digitally like me, but also buy it physically? If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel where we'll be doing daily content on Splatoon and other Nintendo games. And follow me on Twitch where I talk about all these things live before I make a video on it. But anyways, I'm CraftyType1 and I'll see you guys in the Splatlands. Adios.